Hello everyone, Anthony here from the Faculty of Apps with another quick tip for your Apple devices. As a frequent user of Dropbox, I find it handy to have a link to my Dropbox folder in the sidebar of my Finder windows. In order to do this, you will need to install the Dropbox app on your Mac if it isn't already. Simply go to the Dropbox website to download it and once installed, it will ask you to sign in with your credentials. Before clicking next, I recommend clicking on Advanced Settings, which will display where your Dropbox folder is located. And you can change the location if you prefer it to be, say, in your Documents folder or maybe on your desktop. But by default, it's stored in your home directory. You'll be taken through a few more steps until you reach this screen. Clicking on Go to Dropbox folder will open it in Finder. As you can see, the install process automatically adds a shortcut to Dropbox in the sidebar. You can move the shortcut simply by clicking and dragging it, and right-clicking on it will give you the option to remove it. Just bear in mind that removing it from the sidebar will not delete your Dropbox folder entirely, it only deletes the shortcut link to it. If you already have Dropbox installed and want to add a link to the sidebar, Simply find the folder and drag it to your sidebar like so. If you use Dropbox a lot, you can even set Finder to show your Dropbox folder when you open a new Finder window by changing this option in Settings. Click Other to locate your folder and now when you open Finder, it'll automatically go straight to the contents of your Dropbox. Finally, if you haven't been able to find where you created the Dropbox folder when you installed the app, you can always open your preferences from the menu bar. Clicking on Sync in the menu will show you where your folder is currently stored on your Mac and you can change the location to a different one if you wish. So that is how to add Dropbox to the sidebar in Finder on your Mac. If you found the video useful, I'd appreciate you giving me a like and hitting subscribe for lots more quick tips on all your Apple devices. Until next time, my name is Anthony. Thank you very much for watching.